okay. Uh, I gotta put the steel back on there so I can get the holes in the right spot. And then I'll mark them and uh, go back there and drill some more holes. Let's see how many holes are in this thing. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. About 32 holes times 2, counting the metal and the wood. That's a lot of damn holes. Anyway, uh, so there's that. So I'm going to put the steel on there. Alright, this is uh, filmed in uh, 1080, 60 frames a second. And uh, Steve told me not to talk in uh, chopped up sentences, so I'm going to try to talk in a little bit more than a chopped sentence and I'll try to tell you what exactly I'm doing here. And uh, the piece of wood that I had to cut back in the back there with the saw uh, was cracked because of a uh, pitch crack. So I had to redo that and match up all the holes. Make sure all the holes match up and then I gotta put the Burbo! Why do you always have to bark? Make sure these arrows are matched up. This hole, I gotta drill that hole and that one. This one, this one, this one, this one, and that one. And make sure all those are matched up. Just this top one I gotta worry about, really. So make sure all these holes are matched up. Make sure this is right. This thing has been quite a project. I never knew it was gonna be this much work, but yeah, who knows. Make sure the holes are matched up before you do your thing. Gotta put the wheels on there too, make sure that fits. So, don't miss anything, you know what I mean? Know what I mean, jelly bean? Put these back on. Okay, that matches, so leave it there. Hopefully this one will match. I hope so. Let's put this side over here. Put this side of the Yeah, that's where I want it, right there. All right, now I'll get my marker. I don't have to worry about wood as much as metal. The metal needs to be right on. The wood doesn't, but I can just hold there. All right, now let's go drill some holes in that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 9, 2, 12. And then I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, I'm gonna go back in the back and drill them holes. I wanna be done with this thing. Seriously. Okay. Actually, then three more holes. Yeehaw. 
Last hole, asshole. I'll take the bit off of that so I can take it to the back. Put it in my little DeWalt and ream those holes out. I can see through them, so that's a good deal. All right. Carry these pieces back and get on to the next step. Get over with this thing. Put my bolt in a hole. Put my bolt in a hole. And tighten them up with nuts. <laughs> All right. Okay, Michael, what you doing? Well, I'm done cutting holes. Okay. That's all the... Uh, Viewing pleasure to all the uh, YouTubers out there, all 565,000 of you. Five million. 565,000 are our viewers. <laughs> no, ours are five million. Oh, yeah. 565 billion, 286, uh, plus one. You know, the thing, man. The thing. Nice hat. Thank you. I really do appreciate that you did, did notice. Did you make that, too? Did I make the hat? Yeah, I was sewing all night last night. Me and, uh, uh, what was it, Betsy Ross? Yeah, Betsy Ross. <laughs> <laughs> she made the flag and I made this hat, so I'm going to go take this back in there. You want to pause it for a second? Or chase me. All right. I've got the drill bits in my pocket. Hey, Burble. No. All right, here's the drill bits I used. Thank God. Yes, ma'am. Was God a man or a girl? He's omnipotent. Both. Angels don't have that sex. Angels in heaven don't So what you do? You cut you cut a new board because of that crack? Yeah. It was uh, had pitch yeah, in it. That's... See? Yeah. And uh, since we were going to powder coat them, we decided to uh, do another piece. Well, we're going to see about powder coating. <laughs> <laughs> well, it would keep it from uh, rotting. Roddy. <laughs> Over 500 years. Oh, my goodness, Michael. Slow down, don't fall, don't fall. If I fell, if I fell, who would do all your work for you? Well, that's the thing, I gotta keep you in hell. What do you think of that, Burble? What do you think of that? Okay. Hi, Bert. So, what are you doing here? Well, I was lying. The whole lying. Lying if I'm dying. Make sure these holes. I, I, like I said, I can adjust these holes a little bit more than I can the steel, so I can wobble them out if I need to, or whatever I need to do. But they're in there. Now I'm gonna get a pallet. Hey, tell me about the hat. The hat? Yeah, the hat. Uh, look, make up, a, look up here and tell me about the hat. Anyway. So, so I'm gonna put some bolts in here and then get both sides on this, get them attached. Probably won't put the wheels in there, but I'll put the bolts in there and then uh, spot weld them in cor on the corners, like here and here, and here and here, and, and, then, uh, and then go ahead and weld it completely across. And then that way, it should be good. I don't think I can make a mistake now. <laughs> of course, uh, that's just me. I can make So you mistakes. got all the drilling done. Thank God. And now you're going to put the bolts in and then do the welding. That's the bottom line, right? Yeah. And put the wheels on. Put the wheels on, get it turned over, and start rolling around down the street. And, that's even and then, then you're going to put this, lift the engine up with the cherry pickers. Right? And build this cherry picker here. We've got okay, as you all know, what I've done here uh, is I made these uh, 90 degree angles. I've got to drill holes in them. I'm not done drilling holes yet. Because i got to drill holes in the cradle. i got to drill holes in here. And then I'll mark them on the inside of the cradle. When we get this engine up with... Uh, let me get the... We're going to drill this one. One for the uh, radiator holes to go through. This other oh, one. Oh, well, the, yeah, that's a saw hole. And i got to drill the holes in this piece of metal oh, for, for these the, bolts. For the cross... So. I wonder what this weighs. I don't know. It weighs enough. I can tell you that. Let's see if I can curl it. Yeah. <laughs> Three. 
Well, how about that, Andy? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little older than you. Anyway, we're going to get this powder coated. And this is for the uh, cherry picker. Put here on these eye bolts, lift the engine up, get these motor mounts uh, off, lift the engine up, get the cradle out, put it on the... Doing you tough old girl. Yeah, yeah, that's all is it. So we're gonna get this powder coated. Get back, get out, get out of there. We're gonna get this uh, cross member powder coated. Get these powder coated. Get the cradle powder coated. Get the stabilizing cross member powder coated. Get the bars, the Mount bars, yeah, powder coated. Get the uh, uh, stabilizer, stabilizer brace itself powder coated. Get the whole thing uh, in the in the metal <coughs> for the new uh, dolly that we made. Get that all powder coated. Well, the wood too. If and we the can, wood. if we can. Verbal. Go in the other. Go out there. I don't want you to see a dog out there and run out there and I don't because you'd get hurt. You would get hurt. And I don't want you to get hurt because you're my boy. You're my boy. Film him. Film Burble. Look at Burble. He's my Burble. Burble, 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 Burble. Come here. No. <laughs> don't you go out so there. So this we're going to get. We had to uh, get this fabricated some. So the uh, Burble. Come on. So the uh, transmission would fit. So we had to cut this piece out, if you can see that, and we had to reinforce it, if you can see that. We had to reinforce this, I don't know if you can see that, but we cut it, cut it, cut it, put steel inside here and it goes up. Put steel on both sides, and it goes down, and it goes up to solidify it. So, because that transmission, when it's all hooked in there, it just fits right here. <laughs> it's kind of weird. It just fits right there on that. So, anyway, we're going to get that powder coated also. And these stabilizer braces. These right here. These powder coated also. I know maybe, you. I know y'all think we're crazy. Maybe. Uh, and maybe we are. But this is going to be powder coated, and this brace that we made because of the fabrications we had to do to the uh, cradle. So it goes in there. Anyway, all fabricated. That's the goal. Maybe uh, Leo can give us a good deal. I need to go back in, Mom's. Well, I'll get this uh, set up. Well, actually, that'll be if that's the bottom. Well, that's the bottom right here. Show it. Have to be moving. Nancy Pelosi. She gives us so much material. Myself worry.
flip it over, bolt everything together, spot weld it. It's gonna be a piece of wood. Oh, and there'll be wheels here too. Okay, YouTubers, uh, I've reamed out all the holes to so where the bolts will, should slide through. Simple. I'm gonna clean that up. Uh, I'm gonna get a pallet in here. And uh, Steve's going to help me put all the bolts in, and uh, then we're going to do some spot welding. So I'm going to get the bottom and the top piece of metal put in, and uh, then we're going to go from there. So I'm going to get the wheels bolted up, and then I'm going to spot weld them on each side. Uh, do the uh, top first, and then flip it over and do the bottom. So i got to leave the wheels on there while I do that, while I spot weld them so the metal don't move. And then we'll take the bolts out, and then I'll finish welding, and uh, then go down and get the metal, at least the metal uh, powder coated, and then uh, we'll go from there. Number two. Come on, I just want to. Turn that. I need bolts on it. What do you do? Underneath this steel, put the put one. Then you can put the wheels on underneath. So you just move it this way or move it that way. Alright, let's do it. What do you want now? Keep the steel in order. Because if it's not, if not, you're gonna have I'm a hell of a time. Put here like this. Well, that'll be yours. These boards. That one for me. Oh, I gotta put my glove on. I want the, the big head of the bolt on the top on the top part. This way, right? How wide are we going to be? I don't know. You just got to put the wheels on first. And then I don't know how, how you're going to go this way. I don't know how you're going to hold uh, this up. That's what my point is. going to go like this. I want it. Okay, I want the wheels on here. Okay. Yeah. I wear it this way. Right place. That's this goes over that way. That's how you had it. That's the same ass. It's just the total opposite of what you had. Yeah, go right here. Like that. No, it doesn't. Oh, that's a top part. Yeah. That ain't it either. That's it. I can't. Just a minute. I don't know. You're going to have to figure it out. Well, that's what I'm trying to do. 
of steel you can bolt those on there it's coming to life <laughs> isn't it yeah it's kind of funny Good job, Mike. Oh. I gotta put the bottom piece. This one. Okay. Well, the hole's off. I gotta oh, ream out the metal. Wood. The metal part? No. The wood. this wheel on over here and then we can take what's easy oh, I gotta put a piece of steel under here and it says this side up I don't know what that means like that that's probably right because that hole is
It ain't perfect. Pretty damn close. Okay. Box, so what I did is I put all of them together and <laughs> hung them there. Is that hard to get them out of there? No. Are those all, are those all the same size? These are 9 16 <laughs> These are uh, 5 8 Over the years, I, if I can't find something, I just go keep buying them. So yeah. now i got a bunch of them. Here's my millimeters on this side. Here's your uh, torque wrench. Torque wrench. Anyway, I'm still organizing all that bullshit. That was just a uh, out of whack. Put that one on first. One at a time. Looks pretty easy. Tighten them up a little bit. This side, this side's good, so tighten them up. Well, I'm not going to drill something I don't need to do. Actually, they all need to. Have, they'll all need washers on them. Yeah, this is not. It's not going to go down through there though. does good work around here. We're going to be taking those off again now. Yeah, simple as that. But yeah, we're flipping it over. You know, we can turn it on its side. You can get it on its side, right? Probably, but it's easier to weld doing a flat. I've got two more wheels to put on. And then I'm going to spot weld the top, and then flip it over, spot weld the bottom. Spot weld it, spot weld it, spot weld it, spot weld it, flip it over, spot weld it, weld the whole thing, and go get it powder coated. Then you're gonna you're gonna weld this too, right? Yeah. Solid. And then I'm going to grind it off and weld both sides. Make sure it's through and through. 
ain't gonna fall apart. And then we'll just take the steel and stuff down to. Now you're planning on putting the little. Well, well I have them. You could, you'd have to do it. See, that's a six-inch piece. You might do that. You might do just that. Spot it there. Spot it over. Spot it like this. And then, then bolt them through here. Oh, you might have to do it over here too. I don't know if you need to bolt it. Just, just yeah. corner pieces. Yeah. That'll be good. I think that would work real good. Just, just weld it on the corners. That'll be, that'll be good. Well, I'd say you can't. It's not going to fall off. And if it did, weld it again. So that's so if you run into something. See the only thing. Uh, yeah, just just the corners. This looks like something the Vikings might have. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right, let's. We're gonna put something up here. That might be a butcher block on top of it. And you could have drawers and all kinds of shit underneath it. This would be your base. Yeah, but I'd hate to have that not be able to see what we did. If you put a piece of wood, nice two by two, and you put a nice piece of wood inside. And then had to block it up where you can just coat it, and then have that metal shavings under. <laughs> no, you just put a you put a piece of clear plexiglass, then you put a sand and your crabs and <laughs> a fish tank. No, not a fish tank. But a, a funny. Get some nuts. Oh, I think we are nuts. all the nuts and bolts down and around there. Now Mike's going to spot weld it in each of the corners. Might as well weld it. 
I don't think it's going to burn the wood, but I got to take it uh, and build, uh, weld the other side too. Yeah, so do the side. I got to weld here and then on the other side of this top piece. Weld both of them. Okay, so you're just up to welding now, right? That's it. And then flip it over and weld the other side. You want to see how heavy this is? Well, we can handle it. Then flip it over and weld the other side. And then uh, put the pieces like you want, right? I may have to trim some of this wood down. Let me see something. That looks that like. Yeah. That'll be fine. See, it's supposed to fit like that. And then put it there. some of this down so I get to, to yeah. touching and put some clamps on there and yeah. all four corners <laughs> well the big thing is that the wheels fit you want to get it down and roll it around no there you go children there you go Chuck that was easy. Up, oh, Chuck. That was easy. You want to get it off there now? All we have to do is get those boards out. Why? These boards. Just, just, I'll, I'll lift it up and you slide those boards out and then do the other side and we're down. We're out of there. Move that paper so we'll Just slide the board out of there. All that work. Hey, over here. All that work. Sit down. <laughs> <laughs> That's beautiful. We can pull it behind that little lawnmower. Better than they made me. I could put a lot of shit in that. That's a perfect thing right there. <laughs> this is, sit on it. Watch it collapse. Get in the middle. Yeah. Collapse. This thing ain't collapsing. No, get in the middle of it. And sit down. Why? Do it on one of the thumbnail. Sit on the back of it. <laughs> yeah. That could be a good Hold on, dude, keep going. I want to. I think I'll put a seat in here. <laughs> yeah. Steering wheel. <laughs> uh, That'd be a strong car. 